The Higher Education Opportunity Act, or the HEOA, was enacted last August. And it's essentially an updating of a series of regulations on various issues in, uh, in higher education. Um, its particular importance for online higher education, however, is a provision about student identity. It may require schools in the future to verify the identity of students who are taking online courses to make sure that the ones who have completed the work are, in fact, the students getting credit. Throughout the writing of the legislation and its enactment, we monitored closely the developments, trying to get a picture of what the law would look like and what its implications would be. And once it was enacted, we continued to monitor the negotiated rulemaking process, talking with both members and accreditors to find out how they might be implementing this. Within the Online Higher Education Learning Collaborative, we've facilitated uh, interaction between the members, allowing them to compare practices, take a poll of one another's current operations and how they've been verifying student identity and really implementing this, uh, this as an opportunity to, to enhance their pedagogical approach, improve their programs, and make sure they're in compliance with the law. Online providers had for a long time been verifying student identity because of smaller class sizes and because of newer pedagogies that really encouraged interaction. They knew who their students were and they'd been verifying them unofficially for a long time. Sometimes it's through proctored exams, but really it was just through that constant interaction that online delivery can facilitate. So I was quite impressed by that and it was also, I think, reassuring for our members to find out that their current practices uh, were in fact beneficial and would meet the uh, letter of the law.